Good morning, boys and girls. Uh, it's Mrs. Haas. How are you this morning? Today is Tuesday. It is April the 21st and it is 7.54 a.m. in the morning. And I hope y'all had a wonderful day yesterday. Uh, I enjoyed our Zoom time. It was very nice to see everybody. Remember to tell your friends that Zoom is every Monday and Thursday at 11 o'clock unless like we have a holiday weekend or a holiday week or something like that. So today's Tuesday, which is your Education Galaxy assignment. And you can also be working on your other work. Remember, we assign it on Monday and it's due on Friday. I went ahead and printed out Education Galaxy as a worksheet. Just in case you cannot do it on your technology, you have a choice to do it on the worksheet or on your technology. Um, so anyhow, I'm going to go ahead and go over another example today on your Go Math over strip diagrams. So that we're on the same page, I'm going to do a word problem. So let's get started. Okay, boys and girls, I chose to do problem seven on um, yesterday's worksheet. So it's on page 388. So as you can see, I already highlighted and I have my pencil. So, number seven says, Randy has 386 hockey cards, and he has 165 more baseball cards than hockey cards. How many cards does he have in all? So, I'm going to read it one more time to make sure that I understand the question. It says, Randy has 386 hockey cards. He has... 165 more baseball cards than hockey cards. How many cards does he have in all? As you can see, I highlighted my question and it says, how many cards does he have in all? I noticed inside my question that there was a vocabulary word and I saw in all. So I know that they're looking for a total. So I know my operation is going to be either addition or it could be multiplication. But in this case, I think that they want me to go ahead and add. So I'm gonna choose addition as my operation. I'm gonna go back up and in into the problem. And it says that Randy has 386 hockey cards. So I'm gonna go ahead and write down that Randy has Oops, I'm sorry, boys and girls. He has 386 baseball cards, hockey cards. Who would like this problem? My son would like this problem because he's a hockey player. Now it says that he has 165 more baseball cards than hockey cards. So I can tell that not only does he have 386 baseball cards, but then he also has 165 more. So, as you can see, I did it in a strip diagram, and this is my unknown. So I'm going to use the letter T for total. All right, so what would I have to do here? I guess I need to add everything up. Correct. So I'm going to come over here and I'm going to say I have 386. Can you see that? 386 hockey cards. I have 386 baseball cards. Plus I have 165 more. So 165 more. All right. So I'm going to add. I lined up my numbers vertically because it's easier to add vertically because everything stays in its place. So I know that 6 plus 6 is 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. So I'm going to bring down my 7 and regroup my 1, or yes, regroup. 1 plus 8 is 9. 9 plus 8 is 17, and 17 plus 6 is 23. So I'm going to bring down my 3, and I'm going to regroup my 2. 
So two plus three is five. Five plus three is eight, and this is a one. So I come up with 937. So my total for my strip diagram is 937. The correct answer is B. Now, am I done or am I not done? What else do you think that I should do? I think I need to answer the question in a complete sentence. How many cards does he have in all? Well, who is the person that has the cards? Is Randy. And we can say Randy has 937 cards in all, in all. All right, so that's how I did that problem. I showed my strip diagram, it was addition. So I hope that this helps you boys and girls and I hope that you have a wonderful day. All right, boys and girls, that was my example. It was on page 388 and it was problem number seven. It was the strip diagrams. So remember today is, you can finish up some of your work, but it's Education Galaxy Day. You can do it on a worksheet or however you want to do it. Please give me a call if you need any help. I'm here for you. And um, have a wonderful day. And I will talk to you tomorrow. Uh, adios.